Hey guys, the dog right here, and welcome back to another video where today I am super excited to be reviewing my third Avengers Endgame Lego set, the Captain America Outriders Attack. And holy crap, this set is like, like the, um, the favorite set that we never got, and I came prepared this time. Ha! So let's get into this. Okay, starting off with the new Captain America, which was a huge letdown for me because he isn't in a scale suit. But that's okay. Because. Do you mind, guys? Be right with you. Just grabbing something. Totally not related to this video. Not trying to trick you. Swear. Not doing that. <coughs> okay, I officially now starting with Captain America. I officially have every single Avenger. We have Hulk. Just a minute. We have Thor. And but what if I really shut up guys, he's not an Avenger. We have Black Widow. We have Clint. And we have Stark. Who doesn't deserve to be in the shot, but there well, you know what? His legs can. There you guys go, every single Avengers Endgame character. Well, let's just take these guys off of here. Oh. These guys are probably going to die, by the way. Anyway, so here is the set. The, not the set, the character we've all been waiting for. The new and upgraded Captain America and... Wow, here he is, and I've got to say, holy shrap, no one's catching on to me. Look guys, at this new and improved helmet, oh, I forgot how awkward the back is though, but look at it, he's got the wings, he's got everything. Now, check it out. Here we go. Three, two, one. Get ready. Get ready. Yeah. Even though his face looks pale. Come on. It's not. It's not skin color. Because look at Thor compared to him. Lego keeps doing this freaking thing where they do prints onto blue heads and I hate it. It sucks. It's stupid. You need to stop Lego. Okay, this is the last Chris Evans figure we've ever gotten. We're ever going to get. And this is what you do? Are you kidding me? And I don't know what happened with the mold of this. Maybe you're trying to cover up the um, other face, which is right there. That's the other alternate expression. But we have seen figures before where their alternate face show, shows. So, 
Lego doesn't really care about that, so why they did this super long to make it look like hair, I don't know why. So, I might just paint an age Voltron helmet. But here he is, guys, with his Quantum Realm suit. If you guys want to know my full opinion on this, then go and watch my Iron Man Pie Bag review. That's the one with this character. <coughs> <coughs> Gross. Yeah, maybe I should put in the description warning Iron Man is shown in this video. But holy crap. Check out the new shield. The new and updated shield for Lego to return with this new shield. And I will show you guys. I will prove to you guys that it is brand new. You guys are probably like, oh, we've seen that show before, you know, with the back being red and all, and all that light color. Bam! It's gray! I know, I was like, what the freak as well? But look at that, it's gray on the back, that is, wow. Thank you, Lego. I get why you're doing the freaking quantum realm suits, because they're probably really important for the movie, but why not the scaled suit? You have it on the box art, and it just looks horrible. But, for the sake of this video, I'll do a quick review on them. So, the pattern on the suit is great. Little A right there is great. By the way, this is the smallest Avengers Endgame set. So, the new helmet is great. I love it. The head is great. The A is perfect. I just wish that they could get the skin tone correct. And we have seen before, it is possible in custom figures. As you can see, the pattern on here is great. The little dot feature. Um, black hands sitting well. Arms, arms. Red detail on it. It's all great. The pattern. I love how Lego's doing that. The printing on the feet and the, the toes are great. A little great design there. A little great design there. You guys can't see that. And on the back design, each and individual little dot is great. I love it. Especially on the black detail here. You guys can see that. Yeah. So, each and individual little dot is great. The red design here is great. It is all perfect. This figure would have been perfect if you had just not done that creepy back weird thing. And a scale suit this way. And a proper head. And not <clears throat> this head. This would have been great. <clears throat> so, I'm probably just going to take Hawkeye's head <clears throat> and take off. This weird head. <clears throat> Take Hawkeye's head. And then. Bam. It doesn't look that bad actually. It doesn't look half bad. Yeah. There you guys go. Yeah. I mean, why not? Great figure. No, I'm just kidding. I would never, ever customize my endgame people, even if it made them look perfect. I would never do that. It remains as our guy. So there he is. He is cool. Now on to the new and improved Outrider. Look at this guy. Oh, and I forgot to, um, to mention that they don't give him an extra helmet, which is a little strange for the extra pieces, but that's, that's, that is fine. Just reach over it back there. Okay, so there he is, the new Outrider, and they do give him like extra claws so that's cool so if you guys want to know my exact thoughts on this figure go watch my Captain America dropship attack Lego set review for the sake of the video I will do a quick little review torso is great I love the face the claws the new claws we have not seen this yet except for this set it is pretty damn cool Asian individual one I love the red design and then 
On the back, you can see it's nothing special. Let's take about my end game figure. We already discussed this. You guys already seen the back. And as you see, the gold is cool. So, Lego gives you exactly two the same figure. So, that's great. Though, I think you cannot have one. So, yeah. That is cool. Oh, boy. It must be your day, guys. You get to see the back design. So, here is the playing Outrider um, that we get in this set. And, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Lego is really trying with these with these claws. And I love getting them. And, um, I would have shown you extra pieces, but I didn't bring them with me from the living room when I built this set. So, check it out. The new claws. They are so cool. Like, they really fit the Outrider right. Like, look at this short film I'm going to do real quick. Alright, guys. <laughs> to be honest with you guys, my hand was the most scariest thing in that short film. So, here it is. Let's do this. So, there was a new shoulder pad right here. As you guys can see, that is cool with the spikes on top. That way, if, let's say, one of his outrider buddies just tries to come along... And they're just like, hey, I'm going to take you out like this. Ah, poison. <sighs> so you guys can see it is the Wolverine mold for the gold um, gold version. That is cool. And gold on that side. For the sake of this video, I'll do a quick overview. How many times do I have to say that? I don't know. So you guys can see the same thing I just said with the Rossower. But you guys get to see the back design now. As you can see how detailed it is, Lego keeps doing each individual line for this character. I love it. You guys can see the gray on them more clearly now. And, uh, yeah. That is it for the figures. Now on to the build. So the motorcycle isn't all that exciting, but I will review it for the sake of the video. Because it is the main build of this set. So let's break it down. So starting at the front, you guys can see that there is this this little front area where oh boy, if this thing doesn't cooperate with me, it's gonna be some problems. Oh boy, guys, Captain America is not waiting for no Thanos. He's dragging him out himself. He's he's grabbing the guns. He's grabbing the big boys. Oh. Oh man. Better watch out, outriders. Oh man. See, I'm scary with these things. I'm just kidding. <sighs> oh man. Oh wow. Yeah. I think you guys can guess that he's not gonna have this in Endgame. I mean, come on guys, be real for a minute. Well, yo, I get that you're trying to make the sets fun and all, and cool for little kids, and that's great. Maybe that's the reason, but this can either mean two of three things. Two, one of two things. Number one, Captain America will have these Where's your shield, though? Mayday! Mayday! I dropped his shield! I don't know where it went! Mayday! Oh, free! Mayday! Shoot! Mayday! Mayday! Come here! I need you guys! A quick second. Oh no. No, no, no. I just got the damn set. Where'd the shield go? I'm gonna have to edit out some of this. Hmm. Hmm. Cool. <sighs> Never letting go of you ever again. <sighs> okay, let me just slide you guys back on in. Okay, so, yeah, this can be one of two things. Number one, Cap is going to have the gun in Endgame, guns, 
or number two, uh, Lego is just, oh my, why does my shoulder hurt so much? No, that's not, that's not the reason. Or, number two, um, or number two, he, oh, yeah, or number two, Lego is just using these guns because whenever a character holds something, it wears out the arm and the, the hand. And people don't want that for their end game fix, so they rebuy the set. So it's probably just for Lego to make more money, or Cap has guns, or they're trying to make it more fun. But they're just gonna say that. So there's one gun. You guys can take a good look at that. So it looks like the Hydra guns um, that they used to take out Bucky. Remember? That big guy used the gun. And Bucky had the shield in his hand. He went flying. Yeah. So, there it is. Wow, that one works. That one behaves. And then there's this gun. So, yeah. Maybe Cap is good in time travel. To go. Maybe they all go and get special things from time like maybe Stark is going to go and get his suits that would explain the Hall of Armor um Cap will probably go and get his old friend Bucky that's why he's got the motor motorcycle obviously Thor will go and get Loki I mean he knows that house more than anyone that's probably where the Shatari is gonna kick in Natasha, she might go and get some of Oh, Clint, when he's in his mind, when he's, he's good to go. And then I bet you Banner's not going to time travel. But what's Clint going to go and get? He's probably going to go and get his wife. Yeah, for motivation. He's like, you can do it. Don't get hit by a bunker again and lose half of your skin on your side. Because I can tell the difference. <laughs> so yeah, let's get in with uh, the build again. By the way, I don't think she sounds like that. But... So this thing comes down. Hold the motorcycle. And then whenever you go off, he goes off like that. That's how motorcycles go. So you just let the go. Yeah, so that's how that works. This is supposed to be the fuel at the back. You know, it goes like... <laughs> it drives with giant big wheels. It was pretty fun to drive. Oh! Thank God I found the shield. Check this out, guys. Both because I need it and also because it has a feature. So you can literally clip it in. Right there. Just stays in like that. Now, there are discs right here. That you fire from right here. It's a bit confusing to build, but... Yeah, it just... Just goes off. Like that. And it's just these little... Little discs with the A that you saw. In the compound table. Um... Of course, Lego gives you an extra... As usual. So, one more time. Are you kidding? Hey guys. Oh, it's blinding me. Okay. Got it. And then this fires. They're not that great for shooting. I don't know, maybe I built it wrong. I look through the instructions, see. But this is the easiest set to build. There's no way I built it wrong. It's so simple. Okay, so last but not least, because there was a least for real. 
this is the last, and then there's going to be a least. So, right here, cap. Tin. America, cap. Sits right here. And you just... Peg that in, and he sits there. So it's very easy to get him in there and drive him. And now for the least, this thing moves for the headlight. So yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, there it is. The yeah. Captain America Outriders attack. So yeah, that's cool. There's the instructions. Right like that. All the way. The end. I don't normally do this, but I wanted to just because I wanted to show you something. So at the end, right at the end, we have 47 pages. And there's the War Machine Buster. That's the next set I'll be getting. But sadly, guys, it'll be quite a while. Oh, yeah. Advertise. Oh, uh, yeah. Advertising for like life. I know where you place. And then, I think more people to. And then, the instructions. It'll probably be quite a while to review the next um, end game set. Sorry, guys, but I'm getting it for my birthday. So, Hulkbuster set. So, here's the box. There's a reason why I'm showing you the box, okay? Now look, you see how the blaster right here is on the right side and this one's on the left? Now look at here. Cap is holding it and the blaster is on that side. Now I don't know if Lego was distracted when they did this box because you can quite easily swap them so I don't know if they want to show that you can swap them but it even shows that you can put that gun specifically on the other side like this so I don't know if the developers were distracted by some paperwork when they were doing this or if it's made by a machine but whatever the cause, whatever the cause, I'm sure it's nothing. I'm sure that they're not watching this video. I'm sure that they're not watching this video because it's 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 me, guys. Like, I've only got 26 subs. But if Lego was somehow possibly watching this video, hello. Um, they're pro they're probably not watching this and saying. Holy shrap! Uh, we made a mistake! Uh, ow! Probably not doing that. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Alright, there you guys go. The Captain America... Captain America... Cap Why can't I say this properly? The Captain America Outriders Attack... Why? out and so there it is hopefully you guys liked his video if you did sub the like button i really appreciate it and do not forget to subscribe <laughs> just kidding you don't have to if you don't want to but do not forget to subscribe uh that way you don't miss don't uh, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications that way you don't miss an upload and see you guys in the next video peace out and kill a little clip at the end i'm doing for these ow these videos i'm standing up now Stop moving the flipping closet. Okay. Um, so yeah, cue clip and for real this time, a special look at the upcoming episode that will premiere. Can you guess? Can you guess? Can you guess? 
in four days. That's right, in four freaking days. Yeah. So see you guys in the next one. Peace. Mm Hulk, you can't come in. Okay, okay. Um, I guess you could come in through the roof. What is that? Smash! No! Hulk! Smash! Hulk! Be uh, where's the gauntlet? Hulk, where is the gauntlet? I don't know. Yeah, right. I will get the Hulkbuster. No, 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 no. Please don't get the Hulkbuster. Hulk, sorry, but Hulk don't know where it is. Last time, I'm going to ask you, Hulk, where is it? Hulk, don't know. Hulk, better answer. Hulk, don't know. Hulk, better answer. Three, two, one, or I'm getting the Hulk. Allow me to shut you up. Hulk to 
tired for this. I'll get no one for this job. <laughs> Cut the music time for a special look at the upcoming episode for the past within the future. How could this happen? I took such good care of it. This isn't your fault. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Tony, it's my fault because I didn't put security in it. You idiot. Yeah, I know. Well, then let's go get it. <laughs> yeah, okay. No, I'm serious. Let's go get it. Let's go get the gauntlet before Thanos does. How far away is it? So far away from here. <laughs> Four days away, guys, <clears throat> until you see one of my best Lego vids ever. Man. And, I said, you know what? One of my. You know what? The best Lego vid that I've ever done has got to be the trailer that is uploading right now. The one where all 68 figures are in one. No, four parts. So yeah, guys, that is it. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out. And the next, <clears throat> the next Endgame set review will probably be, I'd say, May 26th, in estimate. It depends on when I'm having my party, because then I get a $50 Walmart card. And then I go and buy the War Machine Buster set. And then I review it for you guys. So there you guys go. I'll let you guys know when I'm having my party. And then, yeah, until next time. Peace.